That's my family. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, I gotta go do an interview. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Here we go, here we go, bam. Got it, have a great day. Oh, I told a rock and roller. How you doing, my name is Mike Shaw. an interview process. Do y'all have an open room that's available to be used? Yeah, yeah, sure. Please, you, yeah. Come on, Mr. Boy. <laughs> my name is Michael Shaw. Uh, <laughs> Hold on, that sounds like that. <laughs> my current role here at the University of Texas is Engagement Empowerment Ambassador. I've been involved here at the university for 11 years, uh, four months and two days. I'm counting it down, amen. <laughs> what attracted me to the University of Texas, not parking itself, but the University of Texas, what attracted me was I was leaving law enforcement in search of a new career. I started working at a facility that was uh, laid out for people that were going through elder care. Everywhere I went, they wanted to hire me, but they didn't have benefits. Being a dad and having kids and a family, I needed benefits. So UT had a thing posted for a kiosk guard. And so I was like, kiosk guard, oh, it doesn't sound technical. So I came and applied, uh, everything panned out, and I came to work here as a parking enforcement, not a kiosk guard initially, but as a ticket writer. I started networking and they were like, no, you can't go, but we do have a guard opening spot, so, and I took it. And so by me taking a guard post, it was like, oh man, this is such a dud job, man. I loved it. Because one, it did, it took me from doing all that walking around campus going, oh, vehicle number seven. It, it gave me a different sight on how to deal with folks here at the university because people really don't like tickets, but they don't understand parking is so simple. <laughs> typical day. <laughs> There's nothing typical about what Mr. Shaw do daily. I start my day out every day. I send out devotionals to over 200 people every day. Then I read or call a daily affirmation. Okay, that encourages me to just be focused on the fact that, hey, my job today is to help somebody. I mean, in my prayer time, I ask the Lord to give me the opportunity to engage his people and that when I do engage his people, that I take time out to really hear what his people are saying so I can respond back to his people with the clarity that they're looking for. I try not to downplay anybody. I try not to belittle anybody. My job really is to encourage any engagement that I have. I wanna make sure that you understand that, hey, there's somebody here on campus that loves you. A lot of y'all come from homes, uh, big families, friends, big city life. You come to the university, you're home alone. And so my thing is to let you know that, hey, you're not here alone. If it comes down to it, park it, Mr. Shaw, listen to you. Trying not to miss one student. That's a typical day for me. I love my job because it's really not a job. So it's not a money thing with me, it's a people's thing. Money can't make me. So because I've accepted that in my journey, it's all just about just enjoying what I do. What do I want people in the world to know about the students here at the university? Dude, we're prideful, you know? I'm sorry, I get excited. I have an opportunity to engage students that are up and students that are down, students that really wanna listen, students that really don't wanna listen. What I try to do is I try to make amends with those who are rude, to understand you don't have to be rude to show me that you're here. You don't have to be rude to make a connection with me. So everybody feels like, oh, nobody likes me, nobody cares about me. No, get past that. Love yourself, I love you. If you respect yourself, love yourself, the rest of the world is what's in trouble because now you share that, they either take it or they don't. And from that day, you'll be happy and life will be great. What am I most proud of? People. We got such a big family here that we just got a big mixture, big melting pot of different nationalities, different kind of rela relationships, different kind, I mean, we got a different kind of a lot of. And so my thing is, I'm just glad to be a part of it. And I love what starts here, changes the world. Dude, I've been on fire ever since they came out with that. There's so much here, so many opportunities. I'm just thankful to be able to share that with anybody that wants to ask me about the University of Texas. When you say get involved in your own communities, what I'm looking at right now is the homeless problem that we have. You know, everybody's like, well, you know, if they get a job, if they, you can come up with it until you've been on that side of the street. I've been close. When I got on that side of the street, I got a whole different attitude. It's humbling. I don't know if you guys have caught on to Mike Shaw's gratitude, but I'll go around campus sometime, dude, and just buy lunches and just, I do so much, but I don't do it because the Father does it through me. So I'm just excited to be a part of it. I don't take money, I don't take gifts, I don't, I just want people to just thank me for who I am. I love being a giver, but I also like being that shoulder that people need to cry on. 
or that person that they need to come get a hug and you know just some kind of exchange of warmth you know just to let you know hey you're part of the team that's it I am out here Morning, ladies. I'm gonna catch y'all before you get your hands cold. Oh, so 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 All right, I'll take it. Have a great day. Have a great day. Have an awesome day. Rough. <laughs> right. You doing well? Yeah, doing well. Thank you.